Hey, you know what's crazy is anything is possible if you have enough nerve. And essentially, you know, most people, they're going to see, you know, what you're doing and building for yourself. And they're not going to know your vision. They're not even going to see that it's possible because if, if, if they saw what you could see, they'd probably be on it too. You know what I'm saying? When you have those big ideas that you can see going far and then no one else has done the same research or anything to even know it's a possibility. And then you come and you're super excited and they're like, Mm-mm. they can't see what you're seeing. They don't know your vision for yourself. And guess what? The only person that can is you. So don't allow that to mess you up and get you knocked off course. You have to stay on it and understand you will be a champion because you got to stay relentless on your goals. They can't see it. They won't see it until you build it. And the only way you can build it is if you don't let their thoughts interrupt your actions. Keep acting and keep going towards what it is that you want to do and you will crush it. All right. I was up uh, late last night. I was uploading yesterday's video and I ended up standing up so I could do something to my hair because I got tired of it laying like that. I ain't gonna sleep about one or two o'clock in the morning. I'm tired. <laughs> but that's it, I'm gonna stop. You feel me? So, let's, let's just. How long do y'all hear that? That is. My rain sounds like it's too to go to sleep at night. Yeah. Hold on. But yeah, let's get the day started. So I started this thing where I just journal everything I'm trying to manifest into my life. You know, and I, I speak everything into the present moment as if I've already got it, kind of like a diary, you know, like talk about my day and as if I'm doing the things that I would be doing if I was living my, the life I always envisioned for myself. It's, it's, it's like when you do this, it helps bring in everything that you've been hoping for, praying for, because you're grateful. Yeah, you got you to be grateful. Wake up every morning. Don't check your phone. Don't worry about nothing. Just wake up with gratitude in your heart. Wake up and say thank you for just waking me up. Thank you for having my eyes to see, my my voice to talk, my ears to hear, my nose to smell. Just grateful for the little things. I roof over my head. You know, show gratitude. You know, even for the things that you can't physically see right now. Speak it to us, this is that you already have it. You know, and be grateful for it. Seriously, like it helps. I no longer have any fucks to give about anybody who does not give a fuck about me and you need to give yourself permission to feel and do the same thing. Let me tell you this, okay? People will show you their entire ass to kiss after you have been there for them, after you have gone out of your way for them, after you have sacrificed yourself for them. And those same people will try to make you feel bad, even guilty, if you try to hold them accountable for not being there for you at the same level. And here's what I need to tell you, baby, okay? The fault is not on them because they are already damaged, they are already scarred, and they've shown you proof all along the way. At this point in time, the fault is on you if you continue to give fucks and continue to give energy to them. I'm going to tell you right now, it is hard to detach, it is hard to do what's best for you, but let me tell you what's even harder. Continuing to pour into a crack vessel that will never be 
full that will never be fulfilling, okay? And that cracked vessel is that relationship with that other person. It is cracked. It is beyond repair in some cases. You need to take those fucks you were giving them and put it into yourself, into self-care and taking care of you so you can be in relationship with people who actually deserve it. Man, I know y'all ain't seen like I don't be doing shit. Like I do the same shit every day, which I do. Because it's just, see, this is, this is my new schedule to better myself. I ain't gonna lie, I've been slacking a tad bit on some things. I was supposed to start doing like re reaction videos on this channel, but I'm still debating it. If y'all would like to see reaction videos, let me know. Um, I wouldn't mind doing them. You know, I did record a video, posted it, deleted it because... I don't know, man. I don't know if I want this to be that type of channel. I think I just want to do vlogs and self-improvement videos and whatnot. But, you know, we'll see. But my main issue is when you look it up how to, like, how to, like, come up on YouTube or whatever. Everybody's like, you got to show personality who you really are. And I'm just like. Lady, I went through years of depression. I am going on a journey to figure out who the fuck I really am. And I just be like, fucking that serious. Bring it down a fucking couple notches, bitch. Because I'm heated. Like, I'm trying. I'm fucking trying. I've only been doing this for two fucking days. Like, shit. Give me a fucking break. Like, I'm showing y'all who, like, this is, this is, this is what y'all get. You know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna be like Jojo Sawaya, so whatever that girl name is. I'm not gonna be doing all that crazy shit. I, I'm just not gonna be on that tip. Grown as hell. But even then, I'm just not gonna be on that tip. Not on this channel, at least. You know, if you want to see the crazy stuff, you go on my main channel. But this channel... I mean, I just I want to be raw with y'all, but I'm also in the in the process of figuring out who I am, and first of all, who I was before the depression I went through, everything, like before all the traumatic shit happened in my life. Who was I? Cause that is the real me. You know what I'm saying? But. Yeah, I'm getting, I'm trying to get better at this, you know, this YouTube shit. I've been doing it since 2017. I'm still not fully comfortable, but hey, you know, it is what it is. Um, I'm trying my best. I ain't trained my best. <laughs> um, I want to start adding more stuff to the vlogs. Like, I got hella clothes too, you know what I'm saying? Like, hella, like, that's not me. I got a closet full of clothes as well. And I don't know if I should do like a, like a, what's in my closet type shit like um throughout the vlog or added to the vlog you know as like a little segment y'all know how i do like my shower my all that I'm trying to see do i want to add uh what's in my closet but yeah i am starting to feel a little bit better yeah let me know if y'all want to see a room tour because you know it's not big so there's not really much in here but y'all let me know if y'all want to see that too uh, whatever y'all want you know, I'm raw with it. I ain't got shit else to do. This is it. Um, like, I have to make it on YouTube. This is it. And plus, I want to help y'all. Well, I help myself at the same time. Um, yeah. My main channel video, if y'all are subscribed to my main channel, if not, link is in the description. Go look at it. Check out the videos. It's already up there. Um, I haven't posted a video in a very long time, but that's going to change. Um, I'm supposed to be looking up with one of my friends to post a video. It's a filming video, so I'm going to post. If we're going to film two of them, I just, our schedules be fucking up together. So we don't really, you know. But I'm trying to get used to this vlogging thing, y'all. Like, looking at Kim, looking at y'all, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's going to take time, but consistency. Practice makes perfect. You know, um, yeah, I want to let y'all know that I really do appreciate y'all. I'm saying that every video because I do appreciate y'all. Um, ain't gonna lie, I haven't been eating the best, you know, I've been eating less, but I haven't been eating the best. So, starting tomorrow, 
like so much shit is getting cut out like today I ate uh seafood boil and like that the whole thing I don't eat like crab but nothing like that but I ate, like shrimp, potatoes, um corn, that shit. And then I ate I ate bad today, I ate a lot, I ate bad. Then I ate, ate a quesadilla. Yep. But tomorrow I mean, all that shit getting cut out. It has to. Cause it isn't doing nothing but holding me back. You know what I'm saying? The purpose of this channel is to show y'all like y'all I'm not perfect. I'm in, i am I fuck up, you know what I'm saying? I mess up a lot. But I'm also improving. And I keep going. And that's what I want. We are the winning circle, you know what I'm saying? We 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 do take W's only. And the only L we take is what? Lessons. I told y'all that. We don't take no L's. We don't lose. We don't lose. Winners circle only. This is an exclusive crew family on YouTube. It's just us. You feel me? And I don't know. I don't want to get too in my head about this YouTube thing about like, you know, some people got 20K. Some people got 100K already. If you sit there and compare yourself to other people, you you will never get where you want to be. The purpose of me doing this is because I enjoy doing it. I enjoy filming videos and being my raw self with y'all and showing y'all my journey and, you know, just shit about me. I'd be able to be me and not have to, you know, not have to put on a facade. And the people who genuinely enjoy my content are, you know, drawn to me. You know, those who are not, they flee, you know. It's not about the subscriber count. You know, of course, everybody wants to uh, make that passive income off YouTube eventually, but I genuinely love this stuff. Like, I've been doing it since 2017, really before then, but really, I didn't want to take it serious till 2017 until after I graduated. So, yeah, it's just, you can't give up. You cannot give up, even when it's like, you gotta, you gotta show gratitude, even for the little stuff. Even for, like, I got, what, seven subscribers on my channel right now. Seven. And I love all seven of y'all. You know what I'm saying? I love y'all. Because y'all really are pushing me to move forward and to keep going on this. You know, like I said, this is something I've been wanting. Been wanting. And it's mine. That plaque is mine. As y'all can see, it's mine. It's just it's pending right now. You know what I'm saying? What I tell y'all, I speak things into existence. But yeah. Tomorrow should be a pretty eventful day. I had to take care of some things. So I'm going to take y'all with me. Usually I don't. Like, all the other stuff I be doing throughout the day, I don't, like, I don't really show y'all because I don't know. But maybe I be want to see it. I don't know. Maybe it'd be more entertaining than me just showering and <laughs> do the same stuff every day. But yeah. And y'all let me know do y'all want a reaction video. Because if, if that's the case, I will post um the one I did. I reacted to the Royal Family, which is uh, Clarence the Queen video. If y'all want to see that, let me know. Um, But yeah, I love y'all so much. I love y'all. You know what I'm saying? I love y'all. Real shit. But yeah, I see y'all in tomorrow's vlog. Y'all keep y'all head up. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, it takes some